Millions of pounds worth of stolen U.S. military hardware is being exported out of Afghanistan by Taliban networks. Lines of U.S. Army Humvees and other armored fighting vehicles were seen being ferried into Pakistan. Many of the vehicles will be sold on to terror networks to swell the Taliban's multi-billion pound war chest. Pictures of one convoy revealed military trucks being transferred all the way to Kawada City, in Pakistan, long believed to be the Afghan Taliban leadership's HQ. It is suspected that Pakistan's feared inter-services intelligence agency has secretly given the go-ahead to the blatant export of U.S. military vehicles. Has the U.S. made a mistake? Have your say in the comment section. A source said, it seems the Taliban now have so much hardware left by the fleeing Afghan army, donated to them by the Americans, that they are now exporting them. Frontier City Kawada, in Pakistan, is a three-hour drive from Kandahar and is a haven for terror groups and the drug trade, especially heroin. Many of its population are Pashtun, the same tribe as the Taliban and it is believed the Kawada Shura, the Taliban's leadership council is based there. Get all the latest money news sent to your inbox. Sign up for the free Mirror Newsletter. Taliban figures fled to Kawada when they were exiled by the U.S.-led ousting of Taliban rule after 9 to 11 and much of the money from Gulf donors to the Taliban is funneled via Kawada. Wounded Taliban fighters are taken there to recuperate. The Mirror has revealed this week how the U.S. left billions of pounds of arms and equipment in Afghanistan, most of it now in Taliban hands. <laughs>